Hello everyone, my name is Jesse. This is the auditorium. I react to video game music. As a musician myself, today is my final FF9 song on this channel, Freya Steam. This is requested by Garvin. I will be playing this game for the first time right above my head at twitch.tv. Hey Uncle Jesse, and the VODs will be at my second YouTube channel, Jesse's VODs. This is it. This is the final song from FF9. It's been a, a, it's been a crazy ride. And I can't wait to actually start playing it and hear all these songs in the game. This is one of the more popular requests as well. I uh, don't know who Freya is, but this is her theme, apparently. Freya's theme, Final Fantasy IX. soundtrack is so damn diverse. Suspenseful. Oh. It sounds very cinematic. It's just bouncing back and forth, and it still sounds fresh. I wonder if it'll change at all. <laughs> Manifestation. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be one of these like kind of layered songs. Changed again. Excuse me. I don't think I've ever had a hiccup <laughs> on the channel before. Ooh. Nice strip away everything. Oh, is it ending? You know what? It's the final song. <sighs> Garvin's always been a good requester. Let's go again. I'm not going to write anything down, I just want to listen to it.
What a cool sound. Essentially the same thing over and over, just different chords changes. Oh, I love that. Well, that is my long and wild run with FF9. Freya's themed, I don't know who Freya is, but they sound like a big deal. <laughs> so this is now the 11th song, so I heard 11 songs before playing the game, which is tomorrow. And uh, I'm going to be honest, the first one caught my attention right out of the gate. That was Vamoya Flamenco. Second one was Dark Messenger, and so on and so forth. And I've heard some of the wackiest stuff so far. But out of 11 songs that I've heard, honestly, nothing sounded alike. There was times, I've said just about everything. There were some that I kind of maybe didn't, there was one that like I really didn't like wow me there was one that i didn't that i said didn't even sound like nabuo <laughs> there was ones where i said it will sound like nabuo old school and new school i've said so many things regarding ff9 but my conclusion so far i still have the whole soundtrack to listen to god which is crazy to think about is that everything sounds you know i said this with ff8 before i started playing it and I said that was a very diverse soundtrack. And it is. But this is like... All over the place. <laughs> Tempos. Percussions. Non-percussions. Genres. I, d I don't know, because I'm not familiar with the game yet. I don't even know if I heard a single light motif in all those 11 songs. I'm sure there probably was one. But everything just had like their own identity their own time to breathe, their own time to shine. And I, I, it kept me entertained. You know, imagine, I mean, some people can imagine this, but imagine, you know, sitting and listening to one game soundtrack that you do not know. It's different if you know it, right? Some people can do this all day. But if you don't know it, it can get monotonous. It can get, you know, it could be like work. So I was kind of scared of that going into today because I heard a lot of songs back to back and no other games in between, just FF9. Incredibly diverse, very experimental, a lot of fantasy. I think the, the word that I want to say over and over when it comes to Final Fantasy IX is, is just the word fantasy. The music sounds fantasy-like, the characters look fantasy-like. Don't know the setting in, I don't know the story, but I'm gonna assume that it's also there. So it just has this kind of remove your self from the real world type of feeling and just get sucked into this world type of thing. Like a lot. 
the one thing I kind of noticed in some songs was the use of like long synth chords. Like they'll just stay there. You know, I, I kind of noticed that in a handful of these. I don't know if that's a, for a reason, but just something that kind of was similar between all of them because for the most part, they were all over the place. This one had a very mystical feel. Very, just like everything else, just kind of, what was that? But if, if this is a character, which I'm guessing it is, then this character must be, I, I, I don't even know. Like, I'm trying to think of a song that would go, like a type of character that would go with that sound. Dun, 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 dun. Because to me, that sounded like two different things. It sounded mm, important, but also with a hint of evil, right? The, the main little, dun, 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 dun. that sounds gross. It sounds, ugh. And then the the single note melody sounds kind of nice. Which, by the way, I did notice that. A reoccurring theme in these FF9 songs where there's a lot of emphasis on single note melodies. So what does that mean? That means they're gonna get stuck in your head. You're gonna hum them back and forth. You're going to whistle them. You're going to sing them. You know, if, if you go up to any Final Fantasy fan and you go, dun, 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 boom, phrase theme. That's what I'm saying. That amount of staying power, that's in a lot of these. A lot of these. You know, right now, you know, clear your palate and I just go, da, 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 Right? All these little just earworms. It seems like Nobuo went to this kind of whole basic approach, where as the songs are kind of complex and have these odd writings, every time there's like a melody in it, it's quite simple, which translates to any instrument, translates to people covering them. It's just staying power. It's it's just it's easy to grasp. It's you know, it kind of makes sense now that I think about it. Looking back at all these and people so much praise with the soundtrack, this soundtrack has a lot of praise. I'm talking people like say this is better than seven, eight. I'm not here to discuss that. You guys can think what you want. But what I'm saying is that when people are so passionate about this, that's probably because they're stuck in your head. Not to say that they're bad, but they're stuck in your head and they've been stuck in your head for over 20 years. Whatever how long this game, I don't know when this game came out but it's been stuck in your head for most of your life. It's stuck in my head and I heard it 10 minutes ago. So I see, I see, I see the, the appeal, the magic. <laughs> the only other thing that I can say about the song is that it, it's cool that it had all these little layers that just kept like building up, kind of had this little tension. And uh, it was kind of fast. One of the faster songs in the, uh, in the whole OST, as far as I know. And another one without percussion, I think. Pretty sure. Oh, I can't remember if they had percussion later on. But for the most part, it didn't. Anyways, that concludes my journey with FF9. I cannot wait to play it. Uh, hopefully the game lives up to the soundtrack. <laughs> and But honestly, it's, it's such a diverse soundtrack. And honestly, going into it, I thought I was going to be like just another FF soundtrack. But honestly, it's... It doesn't even, it, it almost sounds like a different composer than what I'm used to. That's how different it is. And yet it still sounds like him. Make it make sense. A big thank you to Gravin and uh, all the Final Fantasy viewers, and especially to you if you're just watching this and you're not even a Final Fantasy fan. Uh, I was there too. I didn't even care about the series until a year ago and here I am. So big thank you to my Patreon supporters my platinum supporters as well kevin patrick shadow maxim vanadel kalanin gardalane mushimary justin and Knox. once again i'll be streaming this for the first time on twitch hey uncle jesse and my vods will be on my vod channel jesse's vods thus concludes another huge game on the channel final fantasy 9 there will be no more videos for it because i'll be playing it so 
let's see what happens and we still have the whole other soundtrack that i haven't heard <laughs> oh man ff9 oh, i see it i see it anyways i'll see you guys in the playthrough my name is jesse this has been the auditorium i will see you all in the next one later